sponsored by Fletcher's Flies, along with Salt Rights and Industry Portage. Yo, yo, what's up, everyone? This is Kantanaka, Wish for Fish, with my co host, Mr. Miles, here. Anyway, I just got back from Spring Creek, PA, State College, or Belfont. I've been digging this fall fishing this year. It's been really good to me. I've primarily been going to uh, Beaver Kill and Spring Creek for my fall fishing. I've been killing it at both. Uh, I did go to Beaver Creek last week and only caught two fish, so that's why I didn't put up a video, but I'm gonna put in my catch in this video for my Spring Creek video, so it will be kind of like a Beaver Creek, Spring Creek combo. This entire trip, I was using a soft tackle by Fletcher's Fly on the top, and about a foot uh, below that, I had on a dropper that was a size 20 zebra midge. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't have any more zebra midges by Fletcher's Fly, so luckily, um, one of my friends that I go fishing with, Chris O'Malley, tied some size 20 zebra midges for me, and I was killing it on the zebra midge. Although I did catch my biggest fish, which was the rainbow on the soft tackle. So, check out my footage of Beaver Kill, New York, and Spring Creek, Pennsylvania. On the board at the beaver kill, fall fishing. Oh, that's a nice one. But it's a nice trout. Oh, oh don't shake, don't shake. Got her in some calmer water. Walked her over here. That's the best thing to do if you're in a tough water situation. Get her in some calm water. Obviously, easy to manage a fish in a calmer water. It's a nice brown, nice looking brownie here. That is a big brownie. I don't want to lose this one. This could be the... Yes! Woo! <laughs> Woo! What a beauty fish right here. 16 and a half. There she goes. Beauty fish. It's a beauty bow. Oh, great golden color here. Look at this thing. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay. 
What a beautiful bow. Look at this. Alright. Let's move this back here. There we go. Whew. Excellent. Zebra midge. Little guys better than no guys, right? It's got this beautiful gold specks on it. Beautiful. There we go. Man, that was a fish. Oh yeah. There we go. That was a nice one. Totally saw that one go. Take it. That was pretty sweet. All right. Ugh. Oh yeah, beauty. Beauty. Oh, they're sipping off the top over here. They're hatching everywhere. Got them on. Yes. Ugh. Right on the roof of the mouth. God. Oh, they're starting to sip again. Yep, they are. Oh, what a beauty. Beauty. Let that one go. Got to get over there quick, because they're still over there feeding on something. Oh! Nice brown on this shallow riffle right here. Got him on the zebra midge. Yellows, oranges, look at the absolutely gorgeous colors here. Look at that, just the red on the adipose fin, the white tail, the red part on the bottom part. It's just very vibrant colors here. Absolutely beautiful. All right, let this guy go here. I mean, seriously, look at this riffle right here. Look at this. Look at that. Not even ankle deep. Oh, yeah. That's a beauty. Beauty cat. Ooh! these colors. There you go, buddy. Woo. So I just took the water temperature. It is at 50 degrees. Uh, it is in the middle of the day. I'm guessing that that's what it needed for that hatch to happen. catch right there in that short riffle uh, once again on the midge oh, what a beauty just a little guy what a beaut this guy go right here I think there's gonna be some more in that oh woo Wow, nice.
<laughs> nice catch. Oh, beauty. What a beautiful fish. Golden colors of fall. Another on the zebra. Size uh, 20 zebra. God. Oh, nice. Oh, what a fish. Nice brown on the midge. What a lovely brown. Let this one go. Oh yeah. <sighs> Lovely brown. Hey, what's going on everyone? Thanks for watching. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do because I'm constantly updating new footage all the time. So you can do so by clicking this right here. Also check out our website at www.wishforfishtv.com. You can also follow us on Instagram and Twitter at wishforfishtv. Thanks a lot guys and catch you guys on the water.